Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we explore the 2024 GigaPress updates. The GigaPress is an aluminum die casting machine adopted by Tesla at its factories in the US, China, and Germany. The house sized machines are able to produce aluminum parts far bigger than anything used before in auto manufacturing. The Giga in the name is a nod to Tesla's convention of calling its plants Giga factories. Other automakers have taken to calling them mega presses, which also can refer to smaller but still massive machines. Here is how the Giga Press works A Giga Press is essentially just an extremely large injection molding machine. Melted aluminum is the initial material, which is heated to a liquid state and then pushed into a hollow mold using a plunger. High internal pressure will be created during the process of pushing viscous liquid metal into a restrictive mold, necessitating a great deal of clamping force to keep the die's two halves together. This all occurs in a split second. The speed enables molten aluminum to fill every crevice in the die before the metal fills the die. The further the liquid metal must travel through the mold, the more clamping force is needed to hold everything together. Tesla has developed an aluminum alloy that also allows it to skip the heat, treating traditionally used to increase the strength of the cast part. So you might be wondering, in what way is this better than the traditional car manufacturing process? The Tesla Gigapress leads to fewer parts being made, lower costs, and a simplified production line, which have already contributed to Tesla's industry-leading profitability, analysts have said. The Gigapress has allowed them to not only build more cars for less money, but it's also enabled radical new vehicle designs that we've only just begun to realize. For Tesla, the use of a single component in the rear of the Model Y, its best-selling model, allowed it to cut related costs by 40%, the company has said. Tesla has pioneered the use of these massive casting machines to make large single pieces of vehicle underbodies, streamline production, and reduce the work of even robots. But critics say the process poses quality and flexibility risks, as a single flaw can compromise a whole module and make fixing more difficult if something goes wrong. Now, Let's discuss Elon Musk's plans for the Gigapress in 2024. By using even bigger Gigapresses, Tesla is currently working on a new electric vehicle that will cost $25,000, which is half as expensive as the previous Tesla models, such as the Model 3 and the Model Y. In 2020, Elon Musk announced his intentions to produce tens of millions of these vehicles, beginning with a brand new, highly parallelized manufacturing process called the unboxed process, which entails creating sizable subassemblies. This process has the benefit of enabling numerous employees and robots to concentrate on these comparatively smaller parts simultaneously and eventually assembling the modular parts to finish the vehicle. All of this could possibly involve even larger gigapresses. The innovative unboxed process, which showed front and rear castings in separate modules or stations independently being worked on. Tesla aims to increase operator density by decreasing the surface area of major parts, allowing workers to access and work on individual parts faster than if they were all merged together early in the assembly process. Additionally, the structural battery pack would be at the center of this large casting, and its inclusion in a single casting would add support and structure. This new manufacturing process could significantly disrupt traditional automakers. Tesla's single-part efficiency eliminates factory robots, making their electric vehicles highly competitive. This innovative departure from the traditional assembly line marks a shift from the linear path that hasn't seen significant changes in over a century. Tesla's pursuit of this new, bigger gigapress could be significant for the company. Working off the success of the gigapresses it used to make the Model Y, Tesla could push the technology even further to make the entire underbody of the new $25,000 Tesla model out of a single part, saving time and money. Another major update of the Gigapress is the manufacturing of the Cybertruck using the Gigapress technology. Tesla has acquired one of the largest Gigapresses in the world, 
called GigaPress OL9000CS, boasting a clamping force of 90,500 kilonewtons, and weighing 9,000 tons, it will be used to cast parts for the Cybertruck. This is because the Cybertruck is a totally new kind of vehicle, using an exoskeleton design that places the structural components outside the vehicle rather than inside like in an automobile. For this innovative pickup truck, Tesla had to completely rethink the design process. This forced them to gain insightful knowledge that they may use to improve their current chassis-based designs. But not just the Cybertruck. The goal of Tesla is to use this ultra-large casting machine to form the entire underbody of their smaller $25,000 vehicle in a single piece. This seems to be possible in part because the Cybertruck's castings are so large given the size of the vehicle. Therefore, a smaller compact car's underbody casting could use similar techniques that Tesla had to adapt for the Cybertruck. Giga castings offer cost savings and additional speed, eliminating factory robots, making Tesla highly competitive in the market. However, Tesla can change their design process if needed. While adopting an ultra-large Giga casting method presents some difficulties, it also has the potential to completely transform the auto industry. Tesla will be able to produce a car from scratch in as little as 18 to 24 months thanks to this innovative design approach, which is a major improvement over the three to four years that competitors usually require. Furthermore, with the right approach, Tesla might be able to reduce the size of its factory and speed up the production of cars. Tesla plans to shift towards a single, more expensive machine for its $25,000 car production, resulting in reduced capital expenditure and greater output efficiency per unit cost. However, key engineering decisions remain undecided, including casting and injection methods. So, what do you think about the plans for the Gigapress? the unboxed process, and whether this new, huge Giga casting will impede Tesla's breakthrough in the unboxing process. Alternatively, do you believe that there is a middle ground that they can opt for? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe. We will see you in the next video.